happening today. Students are hitting the books in one local district. This is not only preparing for a school year shaped by a pandemic, but they're also opening their doors to a brand new campus. Fox 51 Sarah Legre takes us there in Gilmer with details on this new facility and how they plan to tackle the school year. An exciting day. Finally, back to school, Sarah. Good morning, Cynthia. Yes, it is definitely an exciting day, and I'm coming to you live in front of Gilmore ISD's newly renovated high school. Now, I'm going to take a step to the side so you guys can get a better look. It looks like parents are dropping off students right now. Now, they started the construction for this back in April, and they said it's going to be finished around October 1st, and they built it just right next door to their former high school. Now, here's some video of how the old campus looks now. It's completely torn down with plans to be a park lot for students. The new facility comes with improved technology, more classrooms, gyms, workout facilities, and Gilmer ISD's first ever auditorium. Now, although facing the year in uncertain circumstances, Gilmer superintendent is overjoyed to welcome his students back in their new home. I'm glad to see that they're back in a semi-normal setting. We just have to be careful. I've told all my staff not to fear this disease, but to respect it and to, to understand that you can get it, anybody can, so do everything that you can to protect yourself. That's why we have the mask. Face masks must be worn by students and faculty when not able to enforce social distancing. Now, the district is also providing both in person or online learning experiences for students. Now, as you can see behind me, the school is still a work in progress. And like I said earlier, it should be finished around October. The superintendent just added that he is so happy to welcome back students despite these interesting times. Cynthia, back to you. Well, Sarah, in spirit of the new school year, I've got a little test for you, a little test question. Question. Um, what other new addition is there that has to do oh, with the dear. outdoors? Okay, fortunately, I know the answer to this question. Um, they do have outdoor learning environments, and coincidentally, that just worked out. Last year, they took a survey, and this was something that parents and students were both requesting. So, fortunately, you know, although there is a pandemic right now, it's going to help them just being able to do their learning outside. I know when I was in high school, I wish I could do some classroom activities outside. So, I think this is going to be great for these students. Back to you, Cynthia.